Hey, what's up? Castle Clash Hirsch here, and I just had a pretty proud moment of my Castle Clash clear come up, and uh, I thought I'd share with you guys. I've been playing this game for almost a year and a half, maybe longer, you know, since the month it came out. It's only been out for about a year and a half, and uh, I just hit... I guess a pretty big milestone in my game. You can see here this uh, building I've got going right here. This is Mana Vault going on 19 to level 20 right now in 11 days, 23 hours, and 49 minutes. This will be the last building I ever have to upgrade. It's done. I'm done. My base is done. It is built. Everything in here is level 20 or on its way to level 20, and that is the last building that needed an upgrade. So um, pretty super stoked about that and uh I'm, I'm excited to see my builders be five out of five once that's done i mean we're only 11 days away from that happening and uh i don't know kind of scary at the same time i'm pretty ocd and i hate seeing things not being worked so having that five out of five might be a little uh sketchy for me i don't know but uh either way it's it's kind of cool to be at that time I know other people have beaten me to it. I'm definitely not the first person to be completely done. Um, I'm actually not even completely done just yet because they're still building, but they're they're almost there. Um, but uh, either way, you know, we all reach milestones in our Castle Clash career. Everybody's going to reach a moment where they get that next might rank or they get the next level that they've never gotten to in Hero Expeditions or they get to the next level in Hero Trials. You know, everybody's got that moment where they're going to get to that next level. And something I want to talk about is just, you know, being excited for that moment. When that moment comes, when you beat uh, the Mesa 4 for the first time or Mesa 3 for the first time, or you get to Here Be Monster G or J even, or whatever it is that your goal is, when you get to that moment, be proud of it, guys. Because every single one of us has been to that point before. We've all been to Here Be Monster G and farming it, trying to get to that H. That's a, That was a big step, I remember. You know, H to I was a huge step. And basically, you could skip over I and go straight to J. But either way, that's a huge step. And we're about to get a whole bunch of new Here Be Monsters coming in. So we're going to see a whole bunch more, you know, I, like real soon, actually. It's coming. It is coming. You can see we got, uh, I don't know how this is happening. I don't know if it's hacking or what, but I thought I'd show you this. People are already beating K somehow, some way. Hackers. I don't know. That's weird. It's not even out yet. You can't even do K yet. So uh, interesting to see what IGG is going to do about that. But I mean, guys, it's, it's just... I don't know. Be proud of the steps that you take. Be proud of those moments because those moments, I mean, they're not going to last forever. And everybody, I don't know, you should just be proud of it. Because once you get up to a point like here, there's really not much left to be proud of because you've already done it all. I mean, every time you click one of these and it disappears like this, be proud of that moment. Screenshot it. Go show your guild members. Do it, guys. It's awesome. And everybody should be proud of that. And everybody should be excited for you. And if you're not with a group of people that are excited for you, then maybe you should find a new group of people because, you know, a new guild or whatever. Because this is this is some amazing stuff. And every single person's account out there is an amazing account. All the love and attention and time that you put into your account. I mean, guys, come on. We all know that a lot of people spend hours and hours and hours playing these games. And I know I certainly do. And just to see the time that is being put into these amazing accounts is just mind-boggling and absolutely amazing to me that people are willing to spend that much time to do it. We got some uh, White Knights members here. I'm showing off their bases. White Knights right there, GWA, Guild Wars Alliance. That's what that stands for, if you're wondering. I've had a lot of people asking me about that. I've had, I asked a lot of my uh, guild members to throw that up on their base to show support to our allied guilds. And, uh, you know, just something fun. Something fun. This is Pop-Up. Pop-Up just broke. Um, or just got his very first permis done today in White Knights Guild. This is his account right here, guys. And this is one of those moments that I'm talking about being proud of right here. This is a guy who has been in White Knights forever. I mean, he's been in this guild so long. I don't even remember when he joined. It was just so long ago. He's definitely not a new member. 
But look at this, guys. 39k might and 37,000 shards donated to the White Knight's family. And he just hit Permastun for his first time. I don't even, can't even believe, can't even start to talk about how amazing that is. That he's been with us for so long. He's been such a dedicated member. And especially in a guild like White Knight's where we have Permastunners that hit so hard. Um, it It's, that's, that's dedication that he's willing to stay there. Um, and, you know, I've been talking about being proud of those moments you know we can look at some of these guild members that i've got that are just amazing people crazy donations Twenty-seven thousand shards donated we got uh here's this andy rumack this is tam tam has twenty-five thousand shards donated and he's this isn't the first time he's had twenty-five thousand shards donated before that's the real crazy thing with him you know, just looking at all these members, all of these new um, Bakuti right here, all of these new uh, uh, kings that we have in the guild, everybody's accounts, they're just so amazing. And I just want you guys to know that it doesn't matter if you have a high account, high might account, if you've got a low might account, everybody's got something awesome. I mean, look right here, White Knights member, the number three guild in the game, 26k might. Deluxe, doing some awesome stuff, hanging with the big boys. White Knights. Yeah. Go White Knights. I love every one of these accounts and I love looking at these bases and I love how well everybody comes together and not even just in these in in my guild. I mean, we can go to some, you know, guilds that are great guilds that are not super high uh in ranked and you can still find some absolutely amazing people. Um, every one of these guilds, just, just, I guess what I'm trying to say is be proud of what you've done. Be proud of everything you've got. Be proud of everybody that you work with and everything you've done. And I'm probably rambling and saying the same shit over and over at this point. I don't know why. I just, uh, I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that, that people are excited about little things and that you should be excited about them. I don't even know some of these guilds. This is cool. I haven't been back here. I know Dino and Friends. I've shouted them out. I've played on their accounts before. Well, not their accounts, their leader's account. I don't even know. Dino's account. I've played on Dino's account before. Yeah. Awesome. I mean, see this? I mean, we got... This is a guild where we've got high might players right there. 69k might right alongside 20k might players. And I'm sure, you know, this is a great guild. I, I gave them... That's why I gave them that shout out. Look at that 14k might right there. And amazing things. If you're willing to just stick it out and play, you will hit those milestones. And when you do, be proud of it. Go shout it out, guys. Go let people know. Go to go to World Chat Online and tell people. Get excited about it. Because I know I know I would be if I hit that moment. I know I was. That's why I started YouTube. Not really why I started YouTube, but definitely one of the biggest perks I've had about it is I've been able to go share my experiences. And uh, that's it, guys. Big shout out to Naf, Niggy and Friends going through some hard times right now but uh hopefully you guys uh um you know all the old members of niggy and friends and and people you know i i'm, I'm feeling for you i'm i'm loving on you i <laughs> we can i i hope uh i hope everybody finds a good a good home um sad to see a great guild like that just kind of fall to the wayside and uh i hope that i hope that uh, one of these days Something can happen and uh, bring back the old group and uh, keep everybody together. So, little moment of silence for Niggy and friends, guys. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it an end of this video right there. And uh, but yeah, seriously, guys, be proud of what you've accomplished. Every little bit is a great thing. And this is probably gonna be one of my worst videos because I just kind of talked and rambled and bullshitted through this whole thing. I don't know why. I don't know. I was showing it off and got sentimental, I guess. But uh, thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it, especially if you stuck through this whole thing. And uh, I'll, I'll get some uh, more action-packed videos coming out here real soon, especially with this new update coming out. I'm going to be doing some big rolling videos, uh, uh, trying to get the new Snowzilla, still trying for Vlad and Orc. So uh, we'll see what we got, guys. And uh, so there you go. Big uh, little shout-out to this guy who's talking to me. There he is. He's got Pumpkin Duke. Yeah. Hope you get to see this video, little Sean, and uh, hope you stick through it so that you can see that you should be proud of your little accomplishments. So there you go, Bo. Um, I'm out. See you guys.